So the other day, I saved the dolphin. I should say we saved the dolphin, as in my girlfriend and I. Ain't no fish thing, it's a mammal thing. So we were on vacation in Myrtle Beach and it was our last night. We were out strolling the midnight hour. Technically it was about 1.30ish in the morning when we are about two miles away from the hotel room when we happen upon a great black abyss laying on the ground. My girlfriend immediately assumes it's a dog and is like, let's get out of there. And I'm like, no, wait. And actually I was the scared one, but whatever. It turned out to be what we thought was a fish and we're like, oh, look at that. It's a picture. No, oh, actually we thought it was going to be a shark because just the way it was and the moonlight came down on it and werewolves and it looked like a shark and there was no lights to confirm that it was a dolphin at this time. He looked like a shark, no dolphin. He didn't look like this because that's a duck. We are human and of course that means that we have to capture this footage with a camera and she doesn't have a camera because you know we can't remember we have minds like grapefruits they're squishy and we need to save things and we do that through film digital type and anyway we had to run two miles back to the hotel run two miles back to here to take this picture of the would-be shark we didn't have him on that night and what well, you I'm not gonna have them on now either. I get back to the dolphin and I go cartwheeling in to take a picture of the would-be shark and I'm like psh, 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 and he's all like whoa I'm totally Marilyn Monroe and it was a female mammal and I can't tell you how I know it's a female. Just we happen to get very lucky and we flag down a cop that's on the beach because see God believes that dolphins are perfect creatures and that is why he wanted this thing to be saved. The cop comes up, so he goes, right there with a the light, and he's like, I think that's a dolphin. That's not a shark. So anyway, he tries to lift him up himself, and he's, he's buff as can be, and he's like, ah! He reaches out, and he's like, you too. Can I have some help, please? Regarding me, he's a helping hand. A helping that looks really overexposed in the camera right now. Helping hand. So we do it. On the beach. Right there. Mind out of gutter. Right now. Sir, would you prefer to pick up the head or the tail? Um, well, if it's a shark, I, because I don't know if I trust this guy's judgment, I would rather pick up the tail, but the tail looks like it is going to whoop into me. It is all over the place. It is fast, and it is all, and I'm, sir, which one? Um, I'll take, um, whichever one you don't want, I guess. I'm going to give you the tail this way if you get whipped in the face. It, that thing just fell behind me and scared the hell out of me. Hoisted it up, and we carried it clear to the ocean because it was beached really far, like, that far and you don't know how far that is but it's far but we carried it there and it was so nice because he said when you drop it wait when you drop it make sure you get out of the way and the tail will swing back and might even knock you down and i was like so anyway we dropped it and it waited till we got so many feet away and it was so nice and then it went pew and it was out of there and we saved a dolphin, my girlfriend and I, and that was cool at 3 o'clock in the morning, or any time. It doesn't matter. If you save a dolphin, that just brightens your day. And here's some pictures. Long ago in days of yore, it all began with a god named Thor. There were Vikings and boats and some plans for a furniture store. Sell things for apartments smaller than mine As if there were apartments smaller than mine Ikea Just some oak and some pine And a handful of Norsemen Ikea Fuck yeah, save the dolphin